Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. This was a test of the emergency Perlocast system! When you hear that kind of tone on a television, it's usually accompanied by color bars. But how do you know those colors are really those colors? I mean, as you see them, maybe your television is not displaying them correctly. Wait a minute, that red doesn't look like red? Is Chris Perillo really that white? Why, yes I am. <clears throat> Maybe you need to test your screen, I'm not talking about the television at this point, but maybe your computer screen, and you may watch television on your computer, and, and if that's the case, then you want the color to be as true to life as humanly possible, especially if it's, a, if it's a human. And yes, if you look at some of my videos, I appear to have more skin tone than I actually have. No kidding. <clears throat> Head over here, tft.vanity.dk. That's tft.vanity.dk. And you can run a series of tests, or you can download a couple of tests as well, but you know, I'm going to show you the primary tests as they exist inside the web browser itself. You've got the ability to pop open an HTML window, there's an online monitor test. You're able to see uh, the range of the brightness and contrast. And if you can't see the differences between each one of these, well, maybe it's time to get a new screen or to recalibrate your screen uh, brightness and, and colors and contrast. Uh, you might remember the video review I did on the. Uh, let's see, I'll grab it here. Where'd you go? Well back there somewhere because I don't use it all the time but I have it uh, you know constantly calibrating with the light in the room the Huey the Huey Pro uh, of course hue you know color hue Huey anyway you'll have to look up that review later so there's the uh, interactive monitor test uh, you can switch colors uh, with relative ease with gradients you know to find out if you're really truly getting the color as it was intended to be seen at least on the other side of the screen and I'm guessing that uh, if you're like most people, then the color that you're seeing is not the color that you should be seeing because either your monitor sucks or it's good or it just hasn't been calibrated. There's also the input lag and they note that the input lag test can be used to test input lag if you have two monitors connected uh, and they said you'd need a camera to record the counter. So what you do, and it's got instructions, you basically set your two monitors in clone mode uh, run either the program, downloadable EXE for Windows, or right here in HTML, start the timer, take a picture with your camera with both monitors in focus. So basically, you'd run this here, let's start pause, and you'd also run it on a second screen, and you would take a picture to see if, as if it was mirrored, if the same time was reflected here as over here. So you're able to do a test that's a little deeper than a color test, you're testing your monitor to see that uh, the response time is equal on each screen, especially if they're two different screens. I mean, you'd hate to have different response times on uh, different monitors. I mean, that would just kind of be somewhat annoying, especially if you wanted to have a very nice setup. You'd want it to be on par. So the nice thing about this is, as I said, it's all based on the web, tft.vanity.dk. Pretty simple to use, easy. Uh, and uh, I'm guessing that you probably know of another resource that can help you tweak your screen. Nothing to download, preferably. Uh, that's I like that because uh, uh, you know then I don't have to worry saying, oh, it's only available for this platform or another. I mean, we all have monitors, at least those of us who use screens. Some of us don't. I, I understand that. Uh, but this is largely for people who are looking for that extra bit of calibration or understanding uh, their hardware's performance. How well is it doing? How well are you doing? How, you doing okay? Did you make it this far in the video? Cool. My email address is chris at perillo.com if you know of any other resources you might pass along. Of course, you're also welcome to stop by geeks.perillo.com, a vibrant community. Get it? Colors? Vibrant? Like me! 
I'm more like just like super super like white. Do not adjust your screen at all, really. You can take a white balance off this thing, let me tell you. No joke. <sighs> if you'd like to join us in a, a, a bit of conversation, uh, we're typically talking tech, um, hardware and software, not so much about the, the health of my uh, epidermis, the, uh, my skin. I'm never going to age. I, I'm actually 57 years old, and I, I, my, my secret is that I never leave the house. And that's, I don't dye my hair either. One of these days, I'm just going to go gray. It's going to be crazy. Then you will have to calibrate. I'm going to have to calibrate so that my hair is brown. It'll match my current shirt. Look at that. Wee, a brown shirt. A uh, muddy kind of red, brown, brick color. I guess this would be a, some kind of outerwear of sorts. If this, if this shows up green, your colors are way off. Just got to tell you that. Anyway, you're welcome to stop by the chat room 24 hours a day, 7 days a week in conjunction with this live video feed. Me, right here. Well, there, here. Probably right now. There's always something going on at live.perillo.com. We'll see you later.